Hi, this is Suzette with Photoshop in a Minute. Today we're going to talk about scrolling through blending modes to use overlays. Here's a couple of my favorite images and you can see they have a kind of a grungy overlay on it. Doesn't that look cool? Here's another one. And this image is good without it, but it makes it have a more stylized look with the overlay. Now, typically you need to change the blend mode here with this drop down, but this can take a long time doing it manually. So I want to show you the fast way to scroll through those. Now I'm using one of my own products called Textures 2011, and these are all some of my favorite overlays. There's 20 of them in this set. And I'm going to show you how I use the burnt watercolor edges and the aged overlay and my Bahamas wall texture. So let's get started. So I'm just going to start off with this picture of Jordan and I'm going to choose my aged overlay V for the move tool, drag it onto my document. I'm going to hold shift so it drops it dead center. Now, before I go touching this little window here to change my blend modes, here is the shortcut. Make sure you're in the move tool and then you can use the shift key and do plus, 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 plus. Look at that. It's scrolling through all my blend modes. And when I get to one that I like, oh, wait, go back. Minus, minus goes back. That is gorgeous overlay. That looks really nice. Here's a quick tip if you get this with the ugly grunge on the faces. On this layer, you're going to add a layer mask down at the bottom of the layer panel. Go pick your brush tool and set it with black at about 50%. And then you can just paint away any of the grunge that you don't want showing. Pretty nice. There you go. Photoshop in a minute. Making Photoshop easy and fast.